Hi, I'm Mark Polk with RV Education 101, and I would like to welcome you to RV 101, Understanding Your RV. Today's topic is understanding how to flush the RV black water tank. This is not anyone's favorite topic, but it's an important topic for RV owners to understand. Let's get started. The black water holding tank on your RV holds all of the wastewater from the toilet until it can be emptied into an approved sewer drain system. When you arrive at the campground and make your sewer hose connection between the RV and the campground sewer drain, there are a few things that make the job easier and help when it comes time to empty the black water tank. One is having an assortment of sewer hose adapters on hand in the RV. You never know what type of sewer drain the campsite will have. Some are threaded pipe and some are smooth pipe and there are all different sizes of drain pipes too. One of my favorite adapters is this universal RV sewer adapter. This one is by Valterra products. Number two is you want enough length of sewer hose to reach the campground sewer drain. This is why I recommend keeping various lengths of sewer hoses in your RV. I guarantee you the day will come when you need more than one sewer hose to make the connection. Number three is some type of RV sewer hose support. The day will come when the campground sewer drain is high above ground level and the sewer hose support will provide a good angle from the RV drain outlet to the campground sewer drain to assist in draining the black water tank. Next, and most importantly for this topic, is a see-through sewer adapter where the sewer hose connects to the campground sewer drain. This is the only way to really know when the black water tank is clean when you are flushing the black water tank. To properly maintain and extend the life of your black water holding tank, it needs to be flushed after you empty it. Some RVs are equipped with a built-in tank flush. If you don't have a built-in tank flushing system, you can use a tank wand to rinse and clean the holding tank, or you can use a reverse flush valve like this. For years after I emptied the black water holding tank, I would connect my maintenance hose to the tank flush and let the water run for several minutes. I figured that was plenty of time to thoroughly flush and clean the holding tank. Then when I started using a see-through adapter, I realized how long it can take before the water runs clear, letting you know the tank is flushed and clean. It's really the only way to know for sure the job was done properly. If you are still on your camping trip, the black water holding tank does not need to be flushed every time you empty the tank. It should be flushed when your trip is over and before putting the RV in storage. If you have plans for another camping trip in the near future, add some water to the holding tank and add the proper amount of holding tank treatments to the tank after it's flushed and cleaned. The next time you go camping, add the see-through adapter to your RV essential items list and when you flush the holding tank, let the water run until it's clear. This will give you peace of mind that the tank is properly maintained and ready for your next RV trip. Happy camping.